Okay, on today's video, we're going to attempt to test out some speakers that I'm salvaging from broken TVs. Now, you're probably wondering, why salvage broken speakers from a broken TV? Well, the curious thing about it is, these are not broken. The TV's broken. The screen might be broken, but the components on the inside are not. And although in pre-testing these, the sound that I get from them is very low. Because a lot of times what you get is that when you have speakers on the inside of components, they are amplified or they are powered. Okay? So the sound goes through decoding and encoding or whatever it may be through a motherboard then the motherboard takes that sound and amplifies it so it reaches a certain distance from the TV okay so that being stated I just want to test these out to see if it's possible to get sound out of them so each speaker has a very annoying trait and the annoying trait is that, of course, it is low sound. That's not a big deal. But that each one has a situation where I need to create an adapter for the pinout. Okay. Now, pinning out speakers is not that difficult. You just follow the color code. And then you put a pin into that corresponding spot in the connector and of course like i said the sound is not going to be very loud out of these speakers so i had to create an adapter an adapter being a wire that has pins that allow me to connect to A speaker with a certain connector okay so and in doing so I get this scenario even though I've already damaged my adapter it's no big deal I'll I'll fix that and it'll it'll be as good as new so that's it for today's video we'll see you on the next one <laughs> damaged wire <laughs>